Yeah, that'll do it. <laughs> Welcome back on this, uh, what is today? Wednesday morning. Had to Two look days before my here. birthday. How can you forget that? I don't know. He won't let me forget that. Let's talk about the weather because it feels beautiful outside. feels wonderful. Actually, about 65 degrees. High temperatures today. We're going to hit 91. Full sunshine. You know what that means. What a great pool day. And no chance of rain uh, today. No chance of rain tomorrow. Looks like the biggest chance of rain for us is going to be on Sunday. 230-4988 does get Frank this morning. And we are honored up here on this Wednesday morning yes. getting ready for football season. What better person to have than one of the best coaches <laughs> in the entire world, uh -huh. Coach Ron White up here, Tanner football coach, state champions. Keep you got going. it going on down at Tanner. <laughs> Well, yeah, the kids work hard and the coaches work hard. Because you make them work hard. Well, them. Yeah, we all, we all in it together, but I, you know, we blessed in uh, Tanner. We're doing good right now. You've lost one game in two years. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's, that's like I say, going back to the kids, that you know, the, the hard work they have and, uh, and, uh, and success breeds success. So I hope these young guys who we got coming up carry the torch on. Now, you guys opened with Madison Cam, who won the 3A state championship last mm -hmm. year, mm -hmm. undefeated. They lost. The year before, and as you did, uh -huh. you beat them last year. You beat them again this year. Yeah, we're gonna, that's, what, that's the plan. We're gonna go out there to win. No, I told I told the kids yesterday we're not we're not going to play well. We're not going to stay in the game. We're going to win the game. You know? Now you're ranked number one this year. Yes. Mm -hmm. So, how you doing it down there? Uh, he can't tell his secrets. Well, I, I think you know, learn from my dad a long time ago. Just work as hard as you can. Try to outwork everybody during the summer, during the spring, during the fall. You try to uh, relate that to your kids, and that's and that's all we do. Now, I met your dad and talked with you, interviewed your dad back when we had the, the Blue Mount Trophy presentation mm -hmm. for you guys back uh, last year uh, down, at, down at Tanner. Your dad, Coach, did, did, if I understand correctly, did y'all win three state titles in a row? Uh, we won three in a row. I lost my senior year, but... Uh, but you played in it four years in a yeah, row? I played four years in a row, and also wow. my brother won, won his senior year. So my dad, uh, he's been in six, and he won four. But y'all played in the state. Now, you went to, what was it? Uh, Cortland. Cortland. Yeah. They don't have football there anymore, do they? Uh, that, uh, they combined, Harvard, didn't yeah, they? All right, Harper, yeah. Y'all yeah. went to the state championship game four years in a row. Yes. Won three. Yes. <laughs> yeah. And, you know, and then at that time, Hazelwood also went four years in a row, and they won four. And those schools right, you know, next to each other. Now they're together. Now they're combined. Yeah. How do you keep the kids from being just so big-headed, winning, just cocky? Uh, you know, you, are, you you understand your kids. You know who can get that way and who can't. And you know, you say a few things. <laughs> you say a few things to them to bring them back down to earth. And you, you watch them. And as long as they're working hard, you know they can they can be how they want to be. But as long as they're putting the work in. Now, how long you been at Tanner? I started my eleventh year. Eleventh year. Uh -huh. What are you gonna do after Tanner? I mean, there's only so much <laughs> you're gonna be able to take that small school and <laughs> winning every year. What's uh, the next step for Coach uh, White? Day by day, you know. So I don't I don't know whatever so comes humble. up, you know. I know Tanner is a hard working place, and I know the kids work hard, and, and uh, you got an opportunity to win, and I like that. Now, what's some of the requirements you have your players do down there during the off season too? Uh, do you make them do certain things that other coaches may not do? No, it's pretty much across the board in high school football. You know, in the, we start lifting weights in, in December and January, all the way up into spring practice, and then uh, in the summertime we come in three days a week. You know, we condition, we lift weights, uh, we do pass drills. So it's a grueling schedule to play high school football nowadays. Now, how, but your kids are, what I've heard, they're so involved in the community, churches and stuff like that, too. Yeah, like I said, no, a lot of churches in Athens and Tanner, you know, they do, they do a lot of work in the churches. You know, Wednesday nights, we had to get out of there pretty quick, you know, because most of our kids are, are church goers. And, uh, and the community and the church give us a lot of support. Is it so tough working back. with Billy Owens? <laughs> no, he, no, it's Breeze. It's the one, one of the you know, best principal I ever had. He's laid back. You know, he's laid back, and uh, Sweet, I'm glad man. to be working for him. But the, you've taken Tanner to, you know, unbelievable heights now. It seems like it runs in the family. Yeah. <laughs> so is that just, just something comes you naturally. Know, Gloria's saying, is that something you just learned from your dad to, to, to be a coach like that? Great work. Yeah, I want to be a coach all my life. It's all I ever knew, you know, and I'm just blessed to have success. I've had, you know, it could have went the other, you know, I could have some some uh, bad years and it might still happen on down the line, but uh, it goes back to hard work. Just work You're hard so mild-mannered. I know. I, mean, I, 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 I can't imagine him yeah. yelling at the kids. Did you ever get upset and just want to beat somebody? <laughs> <laughs> 
I can get upset a little bit. <laughs> a little bit? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah. Well, let's, let's talk about something else we we'll get back in a minute. You played on Alabama's 1992 championship team. Uh -huh. right? Yes. What's happening down there now? <laughs> uh, I think those guys, Coach Saber has been working so hard, and, and, and the talent is so great. And hard work and talent is hard to beat. You know, I think they got guys coming in every year just, you know, better than the next guy, and they compete. They compete so hard to get on the field because if, if you don't, you're going to be left behind. Can they win it again? Yes, they can win it again. And again? Yeah. <laughs> and again? <laughs> Pro yeah. time. Right. But you played, you played uh, Coach Stallings. Coach Stallings, uh huh. Do you use a lot of that stuff in uh, what you do now, what you uh, or taught by Coach Stallings? Yeah, I do. Especially, you know, in, all, in, in X's and O's I do. And then just um, some of the things he, you know, Coach Stallings was, he was, you know, he was just a guy. He, he didn't take a lot off you. He you no know, no being in him. So you learn, you learn ways. You learn how to be on time. And you learn how to do certain things right. So, yeah, I took a lot from that. I, I mentioned the thing yesterday. There's a new book out called uh, Bryant Namath, and it's called, uh, you know, they keep the, the tide here. When Joe Namath, and, you know, he was the first person ever to be allowed up in the box. Mm -hmm. and, well, I remember interviewing Bear Bryant. He'd just leave us and go walk up there. Yeah. Didn't invite me up there either. <laughs> but when Joe Namath, this is what's hard to believe, in 1964, I believe, went with the New York Jets for $427,000 a year. Mm -hmm. Bear Bryant, you know what he was making? What's that? $17,500 a year. Yeah. As athletic director and coach at the University of Alabama, mm -hmm. so you need a raise. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> you need a raise. So what can we expect you guys tomorrow night? Now y'all playing at Mass Academy, right? At Mass Academy, you know it's going to be a packed house. Thursday night game, uh, defending champions. You know, you expect a hard fought game. You know, they, they, you know, where it is, they, they want us bad. You know, we, we're going to show up and give our best performance. You know, so um, man, mm. yeah, they put it all on Athens. Of course, I know that was a jamboree game. Yeah. But now this doesn't, it, if you lose, it doesn't hurt you really because you're, there are three A and you're two A. Yeah, three A, two A. It doesn't matter in the playoffs uh, standing. But you want to win. You want to start the season all right. But main thing, you want your kids to, to learn from the game. You know, you know, if something happened good, something happened bad, learn from it. And let's, let's, let's use it later down the line. Well, I got to tell you, you have done an absolutely <laughs> fantastic right. job. Yeah. Thank you. I appreciate it. And you're feeling good these days? No oh, yeah. more illness yeah. and you're ready to go? Because at one good. point you thought you might have to quit. Well, yeah, I was, I was uh, sick for a minute uh, a couple of years sick ago. Sick for a minute? <laughs> yeah. A few months. So, but everything's fine now. Everything's All right. Fine. Well, go Tanner, man. Mm -hmm. and good luck tomorrow night. And, uh, are you ready for some football? Yeah, we're ready. I'm ready. Guys ready. We're we, we ready to get out there and play. Well, John, you missed That's a bunch great. of people. You got lost a lot of seniors last year. Yeah, I lost, I lost uh, eight seniors. Five, uh, five guys po played both ways. Four of those guys signed scholarships. So we got some holes to fill, but we got some young guys ready to step up. So you feel good about this season? Oh, yeah. You're doing a fantastic job. <laughs> like you give a shout out to Billy when you see him this <laughs> morning. Roll tight, too. Roll tight. All right, we'll take a break and be right back. Y'all, hang on.